What's up, you guys? So we are here back at the Circus Circus. Now, the last time we were here, we were staying here and we did a full review of this place. And if you haven't seen that video, you should definitely check it out. Now, today we are here to eat. And this place has definitely received some serious mixed reviews. They really have, and they just reopened. So today we are dining at the buffet here at Circus Circus. Woo! vegetables beef stew section here yeah, looks like it's already had a good workout already gravy. and there's like the beef stew right there mixed the vegetables. mixed vegetables Ooh, oh boy oh boy oh boy of course oh dave fried chicken yeah. hard, hard boiled eggs, eggs hash browns chicken. spicy hash noodle brown. rice and spicy just of course noodle. rice oh hmm that's well that's really, interesting there that yeah. looks like a uh, chicken kinda like parmesan. Kind of like a baked chicken. Of That's a baked sort. chicken. Oh, there chicken, it is. Parmesan. Yeah, chicken parmesan. Yeah. We got raviolis over here. Mixed vegetables. Looks like spring rolls and the different sauces for those spring Ooh. rolls there. Oh boy. Boy, people have already been working out on that. Look in the back. Yeah, oh been, uh, my gosh. Picks, picks. <laughs> yeah. Oh, now we got the all. Uh, this looks like kind of breakfasty brunch station over yeah. here. That's the maple syrup. You got the uh, waffles, almost Belgian waffle waffles. Waffle maker over there. Of course. Getting those going. All right. Thank you. Oh, and of course, then over here you got the pancakes. Yeah, we got waffles, I mean, sorry, pancakes. And you got French, French toast, toast yeah. crepes, crepes styles here. It looks like a sort of a peach cobbler almost. Yes, peach cobbler. Yeah. So that's a cheese blintz, actually. Cheese blintz. Cheese blintz right. and peach cobbler. Looks, right. like, a, looks like a... Uh, like kind of tortillas and... A Latin little... station almost, yeah. right? Oh, those are jalapenos. Oh, wow. Wow, okay, those, are, those are... A, woo. Oh, they're really good. I'll have to try those. Woo. Not hot at all. Not oh, hot, okay. but good. So we gotta try some I'm liking the sound of that. So we got scrambled eggs, corned beef hash. Looks like there's uh this is gravy for biscuits and gravy. Biscuits and gravy. I like that. Ooh. Yeah. Country fried steak. Country fried steak, wow. Bacon and uh, that's the, ooh, but there you go, Dave. There you go. You got the uh, corned beef hash. Corned beef hash. I may be hard for those eggs. Oh, uh, you might be. Let's try those out. And of course you got over there the uh, scrambled eggs. So you guys, there's quite a few options here. Yes. Like they're making whatever they got there, the omelets. Uh, I cooked the order. Could I have a, um, let's see, cheese, spinach, and uh, tomato omelet? Thank you. All right. I think it's pretty much time for us to uh, Dive into some of this eating, don't you think? Oh, I think it's time to eat. See I how do it is. too. And look, look what you got over there. I got a little uh, omelets, eggs your way. Here's the uh, cook to order section that you can get. So pretty basic. Yes. Right? But there you go. Time to eat. Let's eat. Nice. We are ready to dive into our dishes here at the Circus Circus Buffet. Yeah. All right. It's definitely one of the more basic buffets we've been to here in Vegas, for sure. Probably the most basic. Yeah, for right? sure. And there's uh, eight stations of basic. Eight, eight stations station of basic goodness. Now we've kind of gotten a short run from all the different stations with the exception of dessert because we'll try dessert after this. Yeah. But there's a lot of interesting things on this platter. Are you ready to dive ready on it? Try, try some fried chicken? I think we should try that fried chicken first. Here grab we go. Yourself, grab, ooh, take that See how this fried Here chicken is. Here we go. <laughs> it looks crunchy. Yeah, it does look crunchy. That looks great. Let's, let's give this a try. All right, let's do it. Mmm. Mmm. Not bad. Right? Oh, what do you think? Yeah, it's not too bad. The chicken is juicy in there. The uh, the crust is nice and crispy too, and uh, not overly salty. Actually, pretty good piece of fried chicken. Not bad. Yeah, I tend to go for the thighs because we like the thighs. Yeah. The thighs have that more of a juicy. I, mean, I saw some breasts that look a little dry. Yeah, no, right. you picked a nice piece. Nice job. Mm. Yum yum, give me some. Well, that's not bad. Right. I mean, yeah. Twenty bucks. Exactly. Not, I mean, it's not the cheapest buffet per person, right? But um, it's not over the top either, right? It's kind of in that mid-range a little bit. 
Well, towards the lower end for sure in terms of price. I'm gonna move this one on over. All right. I'm gonna move this one on in. What do you think we give the uh, the baked chicken a try? So, sounds good. Right? So choose your weapon, my dear. You wanna go for that continuous thigh? You wanna go for a leg? I'll grab a leg. You wanna grab a leg? Okay, let's grab a leg. Grab a leg. Here we go. You're gonna try it in some of that uh, Cheers. sauce? Cheers. No, just by itself. Okay. That's for the, that's for the spring roll. Okay, good. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> the baked chicken is nice and tender, mm -hmm. juicy. You have good flavor. You know, can't complain on that. Kind of mm -hmm. a simple baked chicken, and it's good. Yeah. They didn't dry it out. No. At least not this one. Not this yeah. one either. No, not not dried out. The skin is nice. Just the right amount of salt. I yeah. like it. All right, Bob. I finished that quite quickly. <laughs> right. Now, we are at the breakfast brunch. That's right. And the breakfast brunch, it seems to be a little, for a Friday breakfast brunch right now, a little quiet. Yeah, didn't take us long to get in here. Right, and it runs from, I believe, about 7 to 2 o'clock mm -hmm. uh, each day, right, seven days a week, uh, and it goes for $19.99 per person. Correct. Yeah. Now, there is dinner on weekends. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's calling your name. Right, they have that gap between uh, breakfast, brunch, and dinner, so you can't just kind of come for the uh, brunch and kind of jump on to dinner. You got a two hour gap there. Good point. It's a little tricky. Unlike some of the ones like when the wind used to be, you kind of had that little yeah, half an jump. hour gap, you can jump right in. Yeah, you kind of go right before the transition. <laughs> you know? A little spring roll here. All right, let's try it without sauce. it first. Okay. Not bad. Not bad, just okay. <clears throat> What do we got going on? What are we going to try right, first? Well, it's pretty basic, right? We got the uh, scrambled eggs, got some of the hash there, mm, I, right? some like sausage. That. Yeah, what's that, babe? Oh, chicken fried steak. Okay, we got chicken fried Just steak. Just for a second. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> and of course, you got the jalapeno, jalapeno. Yeah, which so. the lady, remember, in line, she was like, oh, oh they're great, and they're not hot. So, yeah, like, every she, time I hear that. Yeah, she claimed it wasn't hot, so I don't believe her. Yeah, every time I hear that, you say that sometimes. Oh, it's not that bad. Yeah. I try it, and it's like, just yeah, roast she my didn't mouth. have that sinister laugh. <laughs> Should we give the eggs a shot? Sure. Let's do it. All right, let's do it. It looks fluffy. Right, a little fluffy. Yeah, nothing, nothing special there, no. for sure. It almost tastes, um, Batchy, like a right, like a liquid egg. Yeah, yeah definitely not the uh, not the best taste in scrambled. Put it that way. Yeah. Why don't we try this uh, chicken fried chicken steak. fried steak with a little gravy on right. top of it? And I find the hash a little salty too. Ah, uh, okay. I think having a lot of that would uh, eventually wear me out. Kind of throw you, salty. throw you for a so. loop. Yeah. yeah. Cheers. Here we go. Mm. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. I like the gravy. Mm-hmm. Right? Not creamy, not too salty. Nice creamy texture. Yeah. Crunch. It's not too much on the skin. Um, you barely taste the steak as much in there. But That's true. You know it's there. Not yeah, bad. yeah, it's not the lightest skin. The skin <laughs> kinda, I feel like the skin kinda dominates it mm. a little bit. And, and the gravy too. You're right, you don't really taste the steak very much. Before we kind of get smoked here with the jalapeno. Smoked. Try the sausage bite. There we go. <laughs> Cheers. Meh. Yeah, that's definitely meh. That's uh, you say there's hit or miss. That's a miss. A little bit dry. A little bit tough as well. One word for me. Meh. Meh. <laughs> meh. 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 Time the jalapeno. Oh my goodness gracious. Now they are quite attentive here in terms of coming to the table. Yeah. Right, which is good. So, so far, the service has been very good here. Yeah, very polite. All right, here we go. Right, here we go, right about. Yikes, I'm nervous. Don't worry, it's not hot. That's what he told us. First bite? Ooh. Not hot. You haven't gotten to the seeds yet. I'm not getting the seeds. Mm, Second bite? bite? Still not the seeds. Not hot. A little bit. Mine's a little warm. One more? Oh, God. Third bite? I got to be there. <laughs> I, 
I didn't get heat. Wow. So that wasn't no bad heat. at all. I got a little bit of heat. Yeah, a very small amount. Yeah. Even with the seeds. I'm like chewing on some seeds. I'm yeah. like getting nervous. It's like fine. I actually would prefer a little bit more heat on that one. Yeah, I know. You, right? you, you love that heat. Right. Flavor's pretty nice on it, though. Mm -hmm. uh, what do you think? I, I agree. Yeah. The flavor's really nice. I really did enjoy that. I'm a little nervous of jalapenos at times. Right. Especially as you get closer to the seeds. But I could go for more of those. I think we should get about another six more and just have a jalapeno contest here. Just eat jalapenos. No, that's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> So next up was the made-to-order section for omelets. So I actually uh, had an omelet put together for you, babe. Want to keep it healthy. Yes. Didn't, didn't go for the sausage and bacon, which I normally would. But uh, spinach, tomato, of course, some cheese. Pretty simple. Looks, looks pretty nice. Looks pretty fluffy. We'll give it a try. It does. Right? And they're see, very friendly the back cheese. there. Very friendly back there. And they seem happy together. to be back. Yeah, they're happy to be back. They're like, it's nice been a see. long vacation. Yeah. It's been a long vacation. I love spinach and omelets to begin with. Like, right. And cheese. Let's do it. There you go. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. Not good. Mmm. That's probably the highlight. I scrambled and ran for those desserts, let me tell you, because it is coming down to the wire. And they were kind of picked. A little picked desserts, right? Yes. I mean, but they, I, the only thing that I didn't get on this particular one was the, there was a cherry pie that they had over there as well. Yeah. But they do have an apple, they have a lemon meringue, they had a brownie. Uh, carrot cake, and then a whole bunch of assortments of like yogurt and right. uh, cottage cheese, and of course melons, uh, cantaloupes. Right. So different things, yeah. very basic. I'm curious to know if this is like store bought and kind of sliced and put up right. there, because it doesn't feel like the homemade -ish version. Now it could very well be. Should we try this apple pie? Now you're not a big fan of apple pie. Yeah, that's okay. We'll try it out. Okay. I'll give it a shot. <laughs> Are you tell me if it's good or not. <laughs> yes. I'll just. Uh... <laughs> yes. Cheers. Cheers. What is that? Well, exactly what I, it, it, it really feels like it came from a grocery store. Then sliced up and put on a plate and served here. Right, it is uh, super sweet. Super sweet. I don't really taste like fresh apples in there at all. No. Right? Not at all. Kind of expected that, you know, initially, so. It's definitely not my jam, and may not, may not be your jam as well. Not my jam either. All right. <laughs> all right. Moving on. I'll try one of these guys. I'll try a little bite of that. A little, a little bite, here bite. we go. What's a brownie? What do you think? A little brownie. That looks fudgy. Yeah, it's definitely more like a fudge, fudge brownie there. Desserts here are just gonna satisfy that sweet tooth. Don't expect anything right now. Just from what I'm seeing already. Yeah, they're it's all be mind blowing like custom desserts. This right. feels much like it's just like exactly what we said, come from a store and onto your table here. Yeah. But hey, it satisfies the sweet tooth, especially after all that it's buffet like food. Factory to table. So overall, I will say welcome back. It's good to see the buffet here at Circus Circus reopen. I know a lot of folks, you know, that enjoy coming to Circus Circus as well, do enjoy coming to the buffet. Now, again, it did have a lot of negative reviews right. um, on that for sure. And I can understand some of it. Not a bad value buffet at all. There's some hits or misses like an any buffet. But I mean, I thought the fried chicken, that uh, the roasted chicken, I thought those were very good. Yeah. Right, and then of course I, I love kind of the specialty area. Now we're here also for breakfast and brunch, so certainly the dinner options could be more robust, but I thought for a breakfast brunch offering, not so bad. Exactly, I completely agree with that. So a couple quick things, we have an awesome Facebook group called For the Love of Las Vegas. If you wanna join an awesome group, there's a link in the description box below. And also, we just did a video here of our stay at Circus Circus, so if you have not seen that, you should definitely check it out. And take a second if you have not done so, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you get a every time we post something new and exciting. As always, thanks for joining us, World Travelers. And we look forward to seeing y'all in, in Las, Las Vegas. Vegas. We'll see you in the next video.